Welcome to the lesson on Configuring Help Desk. In this lesson, you'll address some common questions. For example, how do I enable Help Desk? Or how do I configure the most common Help Desk features? How do I enable Help Desk? To enable Help Desk, sign in to the application as an administrator, select the Navigator, and in the Navigator, select My Enterprise Offerings. On the Offerings page, select the Help Desk Offering and notice its status. If it's not enabled, you'll need to enable it. If it's enabled, you may want to configure it. In either case, select Opt-in Features to proceed. In case you're wondering, the New Features button lets you review new features by release so you can easily check what's changed since you last checked. Once you've navigated to the opt-in features for Help Desk, you'll see a list of functional areas for Help Desk. In addition, for each functional area, there will be four columns. The Enable column is fairly straightforward. It tells you whether or not to enable that functional area. In particular, to be able to use Help Desk at all, you need to select the Enable checkbox for the overall Help Desk functional area. The View History column allows you to see how that functional area configuration has changed over time, who made the change, what change was made, and when it was made. If a particular functional area has multiple features, there may be an Edit icon in the Features column allowing you to edit individual features of that functional area. Finally, the Setup column will take you to the tasks for that functional area. For example, examine the Service Entitlements functional area. If you click the Setup icon or otherwise navigate to Setup and Maintenance Help Desk, you'll see that there is indeed a Service Entitlements functional area. There are tasks available that you can run within the Service Entitlements functional area. You must have enabled that functional area for these tasks to be available. Now that you understand functional areas in general, it's time to look at some specific configurations. The Help Desk functional area requires that you specify a usage. Click the Edit icon in the Enable column and select a usage. You can select Internal Service Requests, HR Service Requests, or both. For Help Desk, you want to make sure that HR Service Requests is selected. Although the Other Communication Channels functional area does not have an Edit icon under the Features column, it is very important that you enable this functional area if you want to support any communication channels, because it supports the Manage Communication Channels task. So if you're doing email communication, Slack communication, or any other communication, be sure to enable Other Communications Channels to support that task. The Productivity Tools functional area supports notifications, Slack integration, and Microsoft Teams integration. You also want to be sure to enable Adaptive Search. In summary, here are some key points about enabling Help Desk. Enable Help Desk by enabling its offering. Enable each functional area as needed. And many functional areas include additional configurations. Thanks for watching.